In this last step, we want to do a couple of things. The first is to ensure that children can only change the nine answer blocks that we have set up. And we want to make sure that they cannot change any of the rest of the sheet. In order to do that, we need to do two things. First, we need to unlock these answer cells so that when we apply protection, children can still change the, the cells and type in their answers. The other is to make sure that the other cells are locked so that when the sheet is protected, children cannot change the locked cells. By default, all of the cells that you see are locked, so we only need to select and unlock these nine cells. So we select the cells, right-click to bring up the format command, and you'll see here that lock is checked. We want to uncheck that, which means that they are now unlocked, and click OK. If you'll go over here, you'll notice that if you go to format cells, these are locked, and that's true for all of them. So now we want to apply protection to the sheet. To apply protection, we go to the Tools command and click on Protection, and it says Protect Sheet. And this will protect the entire worksheet and lock cells. And we don't want children to select the locked cells, otherwise they'll get an error message. Uh, that might be confusing for them. So the only thing we want them to do is to select unlocked cells and we'll click OK. You'll notice that nothing changes to the eye, but what does change is that I cannot, even though I'm trying to, select the block that says white nose or down here. The only cells that I can select are these here. And if I want to type an answer, I can do that. And you'll notice that the background starts to be revealed. And at this point, you are finished with creating a small game uh, for your children and this can be modified in many different ways uh, and with some creativity you can create some projects that uh, would be very helpful in helping your children learn and older students might even be able to learn the skill themselves to create games for themselves.